What it do, YouTube? So right now, I'm just eating breakfast before I get my day started. Got to go to class. Got to go to work. Anyway, I just received a video of me and my friend Philip Wheeler, who is the main producer, director, cinematographer for all the independent films that I've done so far. What we did was we decided to do a skit for fun. And just to see, you know, how it would go and what it would look like. And then Philip also wants to get into acting a little bit. So, you know, we went ahead and did that. And then plus, I always love acting. I would do skits all day if I could. The sk <laughs> Bless me. Anyway, the skit is from one of his favorite movies that are not too well known. It's a movie called Blind Spotting. And Blind Spotting is about two friends, a black guy and a white guy. Um, there's a lot that goes on within the movie, but the basis is it's not a racial issues. It's just racial stereotypes and showing that they're not always as they seem and that, you know, when it comes to certain aspects of the hood mentality and acting hood, it's not always race specific. We acted out one of our favorite scenes from the movies, which um, is commonly known on YouTube as called the N-word scene. Now, there's going to be a link in the description to the actual scene from Blind Spotting, just to show y'all what we're talking about and where it came from. And we're going to show you our, our own rendition of it. So, enjoy. Give me the gun. Hell no. Are you fucking crazy? Willie Miles, you going to pull that shit tonight? Then what? They gonna call the cops and they gonna come shoot my black ass, not you! What the fuck is your problem, man? You need to do anything back there! That was DJ's homeboy, man! What's that supposed to mean? We're homeboys! You didn't even do nothing to help, and I backed you up in the same exact situation! Cause that was fucking stupid! Oh, so I'm stupid now? Yes! For what? For being exactly who the fuck I've always been? For being hella extra, at all times, Miles, when no one is coming for you! Why is that? Look who the fuck I am, where the fuck I grew up, Colin. This is how I survived out here! You're the one switching up! Alright, you know what? Go ahead, be a hipster, get a tech job. You go act like you don't know where the fuck you're from. I ain't got to prove that I'm from here. So good for you. Nigga, you got something to prove to everyone. That's what happens when everyone around you got you fucked up. You know what? You don't got to worry about what you wear. No one's got you fucked up. You're a black dude in Atlanta with a temp fade. No one is misreading you. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah, my nigga. Yeah. No. Say it. Say what? Say nigga. Oh, fuck off. Say it. Say nigga. Say yeah, my nigga. No. Say it. I don't say that shit. Why not? Because I don't say that but shit. But why? I'm not gonna say it, bro. So, so, so it's okay for me to call you nigga, nigga? You've been calling me that since we're like 12. I'm not gonna stop you now. Do what the fuck you but, want. But, but it's so disrespectful. Then why do you let me call you that? You're a fucking nigga, Miles. You're a fucking nigga. What are we talking about? I'm a nigga, right? Right? But the fact is, you do more nigga shit than I do. Yeah, but... But what? But you're not black? You out here acting an ass like there's no consequences for the shit you do. Meanwhile, I keep my shit in order. When a nigga sees me, he sees the same dumbass, ignorant, drunk carrying kind of shit you do. But I've been handling my shit. Don't I, don't I do our time cards every week? Pick us up? Keep you out of shit? And what do you do? You go buy a, a fucking gun. For what? Your family? You are the nigga they're out here looking for. Where the fuck you going? So there you have it, guys. Uh, just let us know uh, what you think in the comments. If you feel like it, uh, go ahead and watch the actual scene. And then tell us if you think we did pretty good compared to the original. Of course, you know... They spent 10 years making this film, writing it, acting it. So, of course, our performance is not going to compare, especially since Philip is just starting out as acting. And even though I do believe that he did a really good job for starting out, 
it's not going to be on that same level. But um, I think that we did put a lot of effort and energy into it. You know, we spent like a whole week preparing for this scene. Um, but yeah, just let us know how we did. And if you guys even have any scene suggestions, you know, let us know or comment below, you know, if you want to. Um, but if not, we're going to be coming up with our own scenes anyway. That just basically wraps up this video really short, but just wanted to show you guys the kind of things that we like to get into. So um, I'm going to just finish this breakfast. Um, and I guess that's it. So once again, you are watching Perks Corner with Jelani Perkins, giving you wall-to-wall -wall coverage of my life, not just the highlights. Until we meet again.